Hundreds of school children have put their computer programming skills to the test. They've been vying for the top honours at the Lego League Challenge using robots at the Queensland University of Technology. It requires great concentration and is often a case of trial and error. Here it is, it is, it is. No, it's not, no, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Yes, yes, yes. The robots have to complete multiple tasks on a farm within a strict time frame. They've been practicing for weeks, fine tuning their individual robots. It is about having fun and learning through play, but also having to learn about coding and robotics. It's not easy and there are often disasters along the way. We went pretty well, but there are some things that we can do definitely to improve. The competition encourages the application of science, technology, engineering and maths. What we hope is that we get more kids involved in those sorts of subjects so that they're prepared for the kinds of jobs and the way that we're going to be working into the future. It was our first year last year. This year we're so much more experienced. We reckon we have a really good chance of winning it. And it's captivating students of all ages. It gives you more experience with robots if you want to do robot, robotics in life not just Lego robotics. More girls are involved than ever before. We've had to establish other tournaments because the interest is increasing rapidly. The state's winners go on to compete in the national titles in Sydney next month. Andre Withy, ABC News, Brisbane.